Hey guys, so maybe you've entered someone's DM on WhatsApp and you received a message like this. May I know what is your first name? Please state your first name so I can save your contact right away. So you can continue the chat. Now you, you impute your name and say Smith. And immediately you do that, you get another message, an automated message. Kindly confirm your name. Is your name Smith? Kindly reply yes or no. And when you type yes, automatically your number gets saved on the person's phone. Now, this is what I'm going to be showing you. You can see it here. Your contact has been saved as Smith. And kindly save mine as King. Now you can see it name saved. So this is the exact strategy I'm going to be showing you on how you can um, do this yourself and you can begin to um, save contact automatically. So you might be asking, what is WhatsApp automation and contact saver? WhatsApp automation is the process of automating specific tasks or interactions primarily to just make work easy for you. So contact saver is the fastest way to save contact automatically without having to add numbers manually. So here are some apps we'll be using. WhatsApp Autoresponder, Tasker. Uh, we'll also be using Contact Tasker. You will be using an auto notification. So let's get started. If you watch till the end of this video, I'm going to give you access to these apps and um, i'm going to show you how to get them so like and subscribe immediately while you are seeing this video so that i can give you access to it and make sure you watch to the end of this video i will show you everything how you can you can get these apps for free i mean free of charge rather than paying huge amount of money of money i will also be giving you this script for free i can tell you that this works over 40,000 error but I'm going to be giving you for free. I'll give you access to the script. So all you just need to do is to import it and you, you're going to get access to them. Like you won't stress yourself doing it yourself. So these are the apps. Again, you can see them. I'll be giving you access to them. So now let's say you've installed the app and this is autoresponder app. Now you click on autoresponder app, just scroll down and you're going to see um the script there now click on import click on import rules and click on add so the goal is you want to import the document which i'll be giving to you so um, you can see the document there and i'll click on auto save contact does it so once i click on it it will get imported into my whatsapp autoresponder and you can see that these are some of the scripts there for the autoresponder you can see them there these are some of the scripts you can see them so no need to do it yourself I'll, I'll give you access to them now the next thing we're going to do after this is search for tasker after installing the app just open the app and you're going to see something like this so click on the hamburger icon which is at the top now but but this is your profile first so this is the profile and um you won't click there just click on that round yeah the the hamburger icon which is the three dotted lines there and once you click on it then go through um go to data so that's it data so click on data and once you click on it you click on restore click on restore don't click on any other thing apart from restore so i'm going to rethink it here restore click on restore and when you click on restore it's going to open and the goal here is that you want to upload the documents which i'll be giving to you all right so the next thing you do is to click on user local backup and once you click on it it will take you to this um this interface so the next thing you do is to click on that icon that smooth the phone icon and now we are trying to locate the document where is this document so you go to download then click on advanced auto save contact now you can see auto save contact by 
wherever wherever so you click the one that has sml you just check it it has sml right sml document don't forget xml document so i'm trying to make it obvious here then you go to your tasker and you upload it once you click on it it uploads automatically on tasker and i'm going to show you how it looks like so scroll down when you scroll down you see this auto contact regions so this is where all your scripts are so click on it once you click on it it will take you to a different interface and you can see some of the campaigns there you can see them and these are how the scripts will look like but it might be different from this because mine is quite different but you you see them there so these are some of them you can see now go to your autoresponder so make sure that that stuff is turned on if it's turned off it's not going to work make sure it's turned on um, so that it's going to be very effective it will work perfectly well now go to so we are going to put on the notification so all this app so just click on hold your this thing your your app then click on that icon that's how my own works or you can go to your settings and make sure you turn the notification on mine is on so that it can work perfectly well so ensure it's on tasker app make sure the notification is on and the next one is autoresponder make sure it's on so click on it go to notifications put it on so now let's go back to autoresponder now click on that chat icon you can see it there click on it let's test it if this stuff is working now just watch what will happen so let's test it out hi can you see can you please tell me your first name so i can save your contact now to enable you to continue the chat properly does it so you can see it's working now so you must use your autoresponder to test it if it's functioning well then i put my name king if i understood you correctly your name is king please reply yes and once i click on yes then just what will what will happen so just click on yes and it's going to tell me your contact has been saved as king right so the script that i'm gonna send to you you can always edit it to your name so that's the beauty of this and you can see it has been saved so is you can you can um save you can edit it to your name so that you it can um, function in your own terms and your own conditions right so now your app is working and we did this in less than five minutes you can achieve this very well i've made it so super easy for you all you just need to do is to click on the link the description below and you get access to every document and the apps so do well to like subscribe and drop your comment if this video was really helpful to you have a great day